What is this? A curious looking chest is half submerged in the sand. Look inside. Yes, indeed. A uh, small scrap of paper with a line drawn on it. Okay. As you can see, I've caught some new fish too. Uh, barley eye, a barrel eye, barrel eye, and a void eye. Inside its eye, a perpetual pattern repeats. Red cyclones meld through the shimmering green swirls. The abyss burns through you. Terrible. Uh, then I caught some other fish and I've dredged up some of this stuff and a balloon. Um, also damaged the crap out of the hole. I was riding along through here, tabbed out for a second, and then ran into, <laughs> ran into, ran into an island. Um, but it's only one little spot, so that's good. Uh, but uh, back here on Dredge, welcome back. I hope you're doing well. We're headed over to the uh, mysterious guy. What's his name? Uh, also, I'm picking up some other stuff too as we go. What is this? Is this a random? I think it's just a random rock there. No big deal. Um, so I have come to the conclusion we need one more research part, which is why I'm out just kind of trolling around here, um, looking for anything I can search. But I think we're going to head back over to the Gale Cliffs because I know one of those uh, fish I need to catch is there. And I have the Abyssal and uh, Hoddle on, and maybe that's what I need to get in the in the depths of Gale Cliffs. Uh, hopefully, that'll do. I'm not real sure. But I think under the waterfall there was a hodl place or something. Let's talk to the collector. What is it? Um, let's see. What do you know about the old... Oh, did I not talk to him about all this stuff? I thought I had. Um, what is it? Uh, what will you do once you have all the relics? He ponders for a moment. <sighs> it's surprising, isn't it? The attachments we hold towards simple objects. But they are anything but simple. Seemingly mute articles can speak in different ways. If I showed you a childhood toy, you would be all wash with forgotten memories. They hold the power to recall what was once lost. Anything else? Uh, the words you read from that book, what did they do to me? The book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. Is there one in particular you wish to know more about? No, not really. Uh, what do you know about the old mayor, little Morrow? That stuttering old fool, yes, I knew him. He joined us on the waters sometimes, but was more of a hindrance than a help. He never seemed entirely with it. I can't imagine he has fared. I can't imagine he fared. I can't imagine he has fared too well since the last I saw him. Uh, yeah, I just realized I don't have the artifact. No, I don't want to go to the workshop either. Storage. That's the one I want. Boom. Artifact. Now let's talk to him. Pursuit resolved. Hey, we're done with him. Nice. The bond. Jewel encrusted band. You walk in and place the jewel encrusted ring on uh, on a table by the collector. His eyes widen. <sighs> we're certainly making excellent progress now. And uh, I know what you're thinking. An item like this would fetch a fortune at any auction. But for us... Its value transcends material wealth. Regardless, you are due a reward. Once more, he opens the book, dust pouring from the pages as he reads aloud. You begin to feel weak, but you're rooted to the spot, knees on the verge of buckling. Ability unlocked. Atrophy. Instantly harvest an entire shoal of fish. Oh, wow. Uh, as he finishes speaking, you feel blood rushing back to your legs. A strange feeling of power grows in your chest. We're so close. One more remains. I loathe to suggest it, but the Abyssal plan... The Abyssal plane on the approach to the Devil's Spine is likely the candidate. See what you can find. I'll mark the location on your map. I'll mark the location on the map. I'll mark the location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Nope, that's it. Uh, are you human? Your inquiry is met with a piercing gaze. Why, of course. As human as you are. That doesn't seem very truthful. Uh, <laughs> all right, then. Uh, yeah, we need one more um, for the Absol, Hoddle, and Oceanic. And that means I can get rid of uh, this one. Because this is just Oceanic and it takes up the same space. Then I can keep Coastal and Shallow for that. And then we can get rid of this and put our trawler net back on. I think we can work this out to where I get them all. 
on the boat. Uh, although Bones told me I can't, so that's probably more the case. Uh, let's head over this way. I left my crab pots over at the other spot because I didn't think it mattered. Oh, I forgot to put crab pots out here, didn't I? Oh, no, that's not it. That's not a crab pot. Never mind. Um, so we are going to have to go toward the... Um, the volcanic area. So we are going to need a pole that will fish volcanic areas at some point here. This episode also may not be quite as long as last week's. Um, I just really wanted to finish the researcher. <laughs> so uh, it was it was quite the episode, I think, though. We got a lot done. Fish market will sell some of this stuff. Boom. Do we need one of these? I don't think we do. We can just sell them all. It's fun. Uh, this can just go to storage. This can go to store. Oh, I can't move it. Oh, I can. Okay. Storage, storage, storage. Okay. Now let's go to the shipyard. Repair all. Um, and then, yeah, so coastal, shallow, oceanic, right? This does coastal and shallow. This does abyssal and hodl. This does oceanic. This one does coastal shallow, volcanic, and mangrove. Now, if we could find one that's just volcanic and mangrove, or just this one that would fit, that would work out well. But I think there's a way I can run the volcanic net, maybe, underneath this once we upgrade our fishing spot there. Uh, oh, research parts. How much are these? 315 each. That one's 36. We're going to go ahead and buy this. There we go. And then we're going to buy these research parts. Because I need them anyway. Uh, then we're going to go to the floating dock. Um, can I move this stuff from storage? I don't know that I can. Let's see. Uh, from storage. No. Okay. I don't I don't see... What, oh, storage here. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, I don't have to... I've been moving that stuff the hard way. Purchase upgrade. Two more rod spaces. Okay, so that's great. That's our last two upgrades, though. Engine spaces. I need four scrap metal. I've got two. Three. I've got three. Uh, hang on, before we do that, light. Yeah, let's do this. Uh, engine space is more important than the light itself. So let's go there, there, and there. I just need one more, and we can go ahead and purchase the engine upgrade as well. Uh, also, I've got this coastal net, and I've got this too, but I'm not sure I'm going to use either one. This, I'm not sure either I'm going to do anything with. We'll probably just hold on to these for now, uh, which is fun. Okay, now, uh, one more scrap metal for that. Uh, let's go to our research. Boom. Okay. Uh, research all rods. We've done it. Okay. We've got all rods. We're going to get this and replace the one that's just oceanic. Engines. Um, I don't know that I need this one just yet. This one takes up six. I'm going to have to look and see. So six and one. We'll see. Crab pots, though, would be good. Nets would be even better. This does mangrove and shallow. This does coastal. This does coastal oceanic. Coastal shallow. Mangrove Shadow. Volcanic and Coastal is probably the one I need. So we'll hold off on the other research part for now. Uh, I do want to research everything at some point. Don't get me wrong. But right this second, I don't think there's a need to. Okay, so Coastal for the net. Let's go to the shipyard and we're going to spend some money. Because we're going to buy this guy right here. And at 675 we can probably just sell that one. That's oceanic, that's oceanic, that's four spots, that's four spots. Okay, let's sail. Okay. Take that one. And install. I didn't realize I could flip that around to make it look correct. Okay, now we have Abyssal Hotel Oceanic permanently on there. We have Coastal and Shallow there. Right, so we can remove this one. We can probably just sell this one, to be fair. 38%, 82%. Yeah, we can just sell that one too. Which means... We can pick up a volcanic net that takes up four spots, and that leaves us four spots for something else should we need it. Volcanic and coastal. I'm just trying to plan out what we may need here. Volcanic and coastal. This takes up six spots, basically. Yeah, pretty much. There's not a volcanic that takes up... That one takes up three spots, so I could do this... Um, what would that leave me without, though? Coastal, coastal, shallow, oceanic, abyssal, hodl, um, volcanic, shallow, volcanic, coastal. I don't think that would leave me without anything. 
uh, other than mangrove. But I don't plan on going back to the mangroves unless I have to. So we're definitely going to get this. Let's go ahead and get this one. Put it in here. Boom. Okay. And then uh, we could get the, the, the pole as well. 297. And we can, we can put that in. Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. There we go. All right, so we have volcanic shallow. We have volcanic coastal. We have abyssal, hotel, oceanic, and then we have coastal shallow here. Um, so no matter what we're doing, we have them covered all except for the mangrove, I think. I think that's right. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, uh, that worked out pretty well. Let's see. Uh, lights. Would that go there? It would go there. Hang on. Let's flip this this way. How much is that one? It's 391. That one's 192. Yeah, I want to get this big boy light right here. Incendi inc uh, incandescent array. Yeah, we want to get that. Uh, we can buy another bomb. There's more research parts again. Let's get one more bomb here just in case. It's only 37 bucks. All right, let's sleep. That was a lot. I know that was a lot, but that was the point of this episode. Um, and now... We need to try to find some of these rare fish. And I think I can go straight through here. Wow. Camera got really crazy there. All right. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's what I thought. I was pretty sure there was another spot right over here that we could explode. But do we need to? I mean, it's, it'd be good to have that open, but I don't think it's needed right now. I'm just looking around if there's anything else here. Let's go. Oh, my God. Seriously. There we go. All right. What is this thing? Oh, this one's tough. What is this? An ore fish. Nice. Okay, we caught the ore fish. We need to go turn that one in. Uh, I thought that was the case. I thought I remembered seeing the ore fish uh, as an abyssal. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. If I'm not, somebody would surely correct me. Surely. Uh, let's go see anything around. Hey, uh, I don't know if I need wood, do I? I think I'm just down to scrap metal. That's right. Hey, this is the campsite here. Have I checked this campsite yet? Surely I have, right? You dock next to an old rowboat. Somebody is here. He's hunched over by the campfire, muttering to himself. You cautiously oh. approach. Did you? Did you throw it back? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. The book. I think you've mistaken me for someone else. I'm not seeing things. Is it really you? It's really you, isn't it? Uh, are you, who do you think I am? He turns away, wringing his hands. He speaks to the fire. It was him. Him and his damned wife. They dredged up that old book, but something cloaked in fog followed it out right through the boat. Boom! The man makes crude explosion noises and motions wide with his hands, still talking to the fire as though pantomiming a story to a child. It spoke. It said it was coming for our breath, that we shouldn't, we wouldn't be needing it soon. And then darkness crashed down. An age later, some of us washed up on shore, and him still clutching that book. Throw it back, we cried as the fog rolled ashore. We thought, surely, it could still be undone. What book? Silver and crimson. The book covered in her blood. Not making any sense. Throw it back! The man closes his eyes. The man closes his eyes tight as he holds back tears. His voice falls to a whisper. Please, the lighthouse keeper... She saw, she knows where it came from, where it, is, where it needs to go. Tell me more about this book. Oh my God, what, who is this guy? Like, what is this? Uh, tell me more about this book. Oh no, we've already read that one. He rocks back and forth, stare at the flames, okay. Uh, what do you know about the fog? It cloaks the calamitous thing. It's evil. Haven't you felt it? I have, actually. Uh, what does the lighthouse keeper have to do with this? She saw it all. That ruinous day. Oh. Ask her. Beg her. Tell her I... He trails off, his face collapsing in sorrow. Okay. Uh, well. 
uh, then. That was interesting. We're gonna have to talk to the lighthouse keeper now, apparently. What is this here? Ah, metal. We need this. We just need one more piece. One more piece. Uh, we gotta get this thing over there too before it rots, because I don't have to catch another one. I don't know that I need any more cloth. We're gonna let that be. Um, and I guess we could head around this way. See if there's anything interesting. I think I've got all the scrap and stuff that I need. Oh crap. <laughs> I ran right into the light. Yeah, I think I got all the scrap metal and stuff we're gonna need to upgrade. More crab pots. I don't think I can get another crab. I think we tried that, didn't we? Pretty sure we did. Okay. Uh, that was very awkward. Okay. Traveling merchant. Come back to chat. About those rare fish. I found an ore fish. That's great news. I'll add it to my records. Here, take this. I'm sure you'll find some use for it. Oh, yes, I will. Great. What about the other fish? Uh, tell me about the Goliath tigerfish. Use, uh, these guys are legitimately scary. They hunt in murky swamp waters. They use the shade of the trees as cover. Crap. We gotta go back. What about the, uh, what about the other fish? What about this one? Actually, I have no idea where the colacanths may be, but they have a primordial feel to them, don't you think? What about the other fish? No, that's it. Okay, so one of the mangroves, one of the volcanic area, I guess? I'm guessing that's... I mean, I'm guessing that's the only other places it could be. Let's see, cabin. Uh, map. Map updated, huh? Uh-huh. The charred pontoon. Yeah, we're gonna have to get up there and see what's going on. There's still point. Rickety pontoon. This is the camp. Have I been up here to all these? Twisted Strand? Have I been to Twisted Strand? Oh, that's the... Yeah, that's the... Um, that's the mangroves. Okay. Old Fortress. Yeah, I think I've visited all the places. We just haven't been to Devil's Spine yet, which I'm terrified to go to, but... Uh, okay. <laughs> Encyclopedia. Lots of stuff been added to Encyclopedia. Pursuits. Uh, catch rare fish. So Goliath Tigerfish is in the mangroves somewhere. I don't know how to get it. A fang tooth, I don't know where to get. And a snake mackerel, I don't know where to get. Uh, search for relics. Find the watch in Devil's Spine. Okay, so I'm guessing we're going to have a whole nother episode in the Devil's Spine because... Yeah. Oh, we haven't done this one. Um, a plan for the future. I forgot to start that. Crap. Okay. Uh, let's see. Research part. Let's go to cargo. Got three research parts now. Let's go ahead and do the shipyard. Uh. No, sorry, the wrong one. Let's go to the floating dock. Let's get our engine upgrade complete. Boom. We can't purchase it yet, but it's there. Uh, and then we'll just send this stuff to storage, I guess, because... Oh, no, we still have two here. Hey, that works out really well. Boom. Uh, no cloth needed. But I do have two more boards, so we just need one more board, and we don't have to find any more of this stuff at all. That's pretty great, honestly. And I'm glad I kept this guy, because that means we can go back to the mangrove and not have to do anything crazy, you know? even that up a bit. I can't move it from here for some reason. That's very strange. Uh, I've got three research parts and I got my volcanic stuff ready. This may be the episode. But I doubt it. I doubt it because we've already we, we've already passed a lot of time. I don't want this episode to be another hour. So, <laughs> Catchable types of fish. So we got coastal, hodl, shallow, volcanic, oceanic, dredge, and abyssal. So yeah. I mean, we're we're pretty good here um, on the amount of fish we can we can cover. So that's pretty good. We just need to get make some money now, I guess. Fish market. Do I have any fish on me? Oh, I do. I'll get this. Can I sell this? I mean, I guess I can. Okay, hundred eighty-five dollars. I'll take it. Uh, yeah. Let's go back to the shipyard. Maybe I can sell that. There we go. And I guess I could probably. Sell some of these other, um, sell some of these other things. Let's go to the storage here. I guess I could sell this net. That does coastal and volcanic. This just does coastal. So yeah, we could sell this. Uh, I need to keep that though for sure. I don't think I can sell any of this stuff here, can I? I don't know what this does. Scrap piece of paper. We can get, sell the mixed bait. But I don't want to. We, we can't sell this. We can discard it if we wanted, but I'm not going to. 
All right, I think that's pretty much all I can sell. Probably need to sleep, do some fishing real quick, and then we'll head... Um, we might end this episode headed over to uh, the scary place, the scary bits. And I've got some crab pots somewhere. Where are they at? Oh, they're actually over here. Holy crap, I didn't realize I dropped them way over there. Okay. Okay, research. Engines. Pots. Pots would be good. Uh, two to three, it's a five, four. That's a, that's a big boy, whatever that is. Nets is the one we want, right? Let's see. Mangrove and shallow would be good, but I don't think we're going to pick up a rare fish with the mangrove net. Um, we can get it later if need be. Large trawl net. I mean, this would be great. It picks up 12 per day, but so does this one. Coastal shallow. Coastal oceanic. And I don't know, that's a big boy net right there. What was, what were we going to research next? Because I don't remember. We got all the rods. Um, did I say pots, maybe? I mean, maybe? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what to research next. I'm not going to lie. Uh, having the trawl nets would be good. That way, if I go to the mangroves, I can just switch this one on. Right? Mangrove and shallow. This one's volcanic and coastal. But we're headed there next. So maybe we research this. And then maybe put one in the engines. I'm really not sure what to do here. I'm going to hold on to these, I think. And then we'll we'll work on that later. Because I don't know which one to pick up right now. I'm, I'm not even going to lie to you. I have no clue what I want to do. Let's go to float and dock real quick because I think I have the money. Two more engine spots. Sweet. All right, now we can go assess this part here. Um, engines, right? If we research that last one, uh, it's like... What is this? 14-7. Um, see, this one's 14-7. This one's 15. Improved outboard. I don't think we can get that one in there. That one's four spaces. Can't get that one in there. I think this one's probably the best option to add to this. I would add 15 knots. But I really want this light right here. 391. And if I sold this, I would be able to get it. Yeah. Boom. Have a combined light strength of 3,000 lumens. Oh, nice. Okay, we got another achievement. Uh, so let's see. Let's move that to there then. Or maybe even down here. Just out of the way. $85. Not a whole lot to do anything with. Uh, 1,600. You know what I think? I've been thinking about this. I think I want to run back up and catch the the fish at the mangroves because I can just switch these out right here for the anti-tangle and the net that is mangrove only and run up there and see if I can catch that one fish I think I want to do that actually mm. that'll finish off the I keep going to the wrong one uh no that's right yeah. I just need to repair yeah there we go uh I think I want to do that it's gonna be kind of a pain but I think that's what I want to do Oh, wait a minute, we can't, can we? Research nets. Mangrove. Oh, we can, yeah. Okay. I now need to get the money to install that, though. That's going to be an issue. Let's see. Shipyard. How much is it? Nets. It is 315. Okay. That shouldn't be that good. Go catch some fish. Okay, it's time. Time to do this. And then we'll head up to the mangrove. Uh, let's see. Skipyard. Nets. Mangrove. Alright, how much money do I need? Oh, wow, the pole now. 315 for that as well. So we just need a couple more dollars. Not a big deal. I think we have enough now to buy it. Yes. Mangrove and coastal. Okay, so we're set up for mangroves again. We still have our Avasol, uh, Avasol, Hoddle, and Oceanic. Got our coastal and shallow there. Uh, yeah, everything looks good. We got our crab pots. We can just drop probably over here somewhere. We're about to head back to the mangroves. That's killer whales. These guys have been attacking boats recently. You guys seen that in the news? 
Crazy, right? Yeah. Wild stuff. Hello. Crooked boulder with a small, simple platform. Twisted shape of the deformed fish is barely recognizable. The waves lap up to the platform where you laid the aberration. Aberration. The water makes contact with it. A buzzing sound fills the air. Previously still water bubbles up, oh, uh, bub bubbles up and over, obscuring the fish for a few moments. Later, a few moments later, when the water calms, something else is on the platform. Oh my goodness. Uh, oceanic, mangrove, and shallow. Oh, takes up six slots though, but we're, yeah, we're putting it in storage for sure. Oh my god, okay. Oh crap, come on. The fathom, fathomless winch disabled. That's okay, we don't need that right now anyway. We're in the mangroves. That's cool. I didn't find that last time, I don't think. Some loose debris. I picked up some more explosives. I'm glad I did. I haven't seen this yet, so maybe it's back here. Blistered tarp undiscovered. Okay. Oh, got a ring. Yeah, that's something. Oh my god, look at the size of this thing. Holy crap, it takes up eight spots. Goliath tigerfish. Species added to the encyclopedia. We found it, finally. What in the world was that? Is that a crocodile again? Uh, yeah, that took a minute. I've been riding around for a while trying to find this thing. I don't want to lose it now because I'm running stuff over. That would really upset me. Gotta catch one of these creepy catfish too. There's an achievement if you catch all these weird fish in the game. That's the reason I, I constantly am looking for them. But I, I don't think I'll ever get that achievement. I'm gonna be, oh my god. I'll be honest. Yeah, I don't think I'll ever get the achievement. Doesn't mean we can't try though. Uh, I guess we probably need to hit this though. There we go. Nightwing catfish hooked barbells seek out prey in twisting mangroves one sluggish fish given haste upon crimson fins kind of creepy there we go all right we are done with the mangroves we caught the giant goliath uh whatever fish <laughs> uh traveling merchant yes about those rare fish i found the goliath tiger fish that one yeah uh add it to the collection I guess I can sell it too. I mean, I guess so. Yeah, I can sell it. All right, cool. I'm guessing the last one's probably going to be in the um, uh, volcanic area or whatever, whatever it's called. Fish market. Yeah, we can sell this bad boy. Fearsome predatory. This gigantic fish is also one of the most aggressive. Its teeth are so large that they punch holes through opposing jaws. Yeesh. That was a good find. I still like this catfish, though. It's probably one of my favorite ones I've seen so far. The Nightwing catfish. You will be remembered. Oh, also this guy. Blistered tarpon. That thing's gross. Yeesh. Cargo. Storage. Uh, also, we have a new crab pot, too, by the way. So that's cool. Uh, I think now we can switch and put all this other stuff back on. Uh, I like this thing. This thing looks crazy. I'm not going to use it, but it looks cool. Yeah, it looks cool. About as far as I'm going to go with it, though. <laughs> Flip that around. Do that. Got to save space here. Okay. Let's go repair things, and then we'll head off to the volcanic islands. I've been researching crab pots. Oh, I can't research that one yet. Dang. I was really hoping I could. Oh, this one. Okay. Nine days. Six by five. Three per day. That's incredible. Oh, we don't have any more research parts. All right, so this one's three per day. It's a five by four. This one's a five by five. It's two to three per day. This one is three per day. Nine days is what that one goes. We've come a long way since the three days uh, and the two per day, three days, uh, and the four by fours. Yeah. Uh, next up is the engine. We're going to get this engine right here, and then we'll get the rest of these nets too. I want to get all of the research done, all of it. Um, and I don't think, I think every time we, oh, we can. Every time we leave and come back, we can buy more. That's good. Uh, let's see. Let's put this down here, too. Uh, that is awesome. Okay. Well, that's good. Pots. Uh, let's go ahead and knock that out, then. There we go. Uh, research all pots. Sweet. 
I'm not really one for achievement hunting, but uh, let's go to my storage and we'll detach the mangrove. One, there we go, and detach the mangrove um, net. We'll put this trawl net on. Takes a minute. And then we'll put this fishing line on. And we'll do it like that. It leaves me this open area here if I need it. And I can move these up top. Or I can put these down here and just pretend they're not there. That'll work. Okay, there we go. Only one fish left to catch. And, uh... That'll complete that. And we need to head back this way. Um... Actually, we just need to go across to the, the charred pontoon here. Uh, that's right there. Probably still point... Where's Greater Mario? Yeah, let's head over to Still Point first. So we're headed directly there right now. Head over to Still Point and then we'll make our way over to the volcanic area. And hopefully we catch some cool stuff. Oh, I need to drop my ball net. There we go. I want to make sure we're running that all the time. I don't see anything on these islands out here. But we're going to drive out here just to see. And hopefully we don't get killed by anything big. Um, you never know with this game what's going to be out in front of you but there's the volcanic islands I'm guessing the twisted strand is where we're headed next uh, oh what are these hello I don't think I've seen these yet oh it's a snake mackerel oh my god we caught one hang on Kevin pursuits catch a snake mackerel bring it back to him figure in blue oh my god okay uh, we need to catch another one of these. I can't believe it's just right here. That's so odd. Um, we need to run this over right now. Figure in blue. Uh, pale skate species added. Okay, that's cool. A building over here or something. Here. This used to be a building, it looks like. Twisted Strand is an odd place, isn't it? Very, very strange looking place. Lots of building debris here. Something back here. Is that a figure in red? Please no. Not again. No, what is this? Oh, it is a figure in red. Crap. You approach a hooded figure. They're standing expectantly. Vermilion red robes blowing in the wind. Fishermen, serve. The voice from the red hook cuts through the humid air. Deliver the vessel. Deliver the vessel. But a figure produces an old paper scroll. They point to a shape, a cusk eel. Okay. Need to deliver a cusk eel. We need to get back to the guy in blue, though. I don't know what these are, either. Volcanic. What is the... Oh, my God. What happened to this guy? These things are weird looking. Okay, let's get out of here. It's 1500. Uh, I need to get back to the figure in blue and get this delivered. I don't know if we're going to have time, I'm going to be honest. Oh no, put the net back down. I need my light on. Uh, I don't even remember where the figure in blue was. Is it one of these? No, that's Blackstone. Ingfell. It's going to be one of these islands right here. I just don't remember which one. Um, maybe that one. Where are we at right now? Oh my god, we're so far up here. Okay, well, let's go and see if we can make it back. Uh, I need to do it before I sleep, though, because I don't want these fish to go bad. Pretty sure one of them was here. Aha! It's him. The blue figure. Almost fulfilled. They point to a fish on the final scroll. The snake mackerel. Got it. The fish has barely left your hands before the splintered nails begin peeling at its scales. The heart is extracted and devoured. Pursuit resolved. Haggling and bartering a god added to the cabin. Their head tilts upward to look at you. They take a book from inside their robe and hand it over. Hunger, Satan. Now I wait. Cross their arms and appear to fall asleep. Okay. Very weird, but we're done with that one. Uh, I do need to catch one more thing, and I don't know what it is. We're going to head over here and sleep and then head back up there. Though. Something slithered into my cargo hold. Oh my god. What did we just, what did we just do? Oh, 
a snake mackerel with infected. Uh, what does that mean? Infected, slender with dull black eyes and long snout. No, what is it? What infected it? Been standing there for a while. Need a rest? Yes, we do. But I mean, I guess we sell it. I don't know what else to do with it. A pale skate. These things are worth some money. Uh, what is the last... Um, what's the last thing we needed here? Let's go cabin. On the shelf. We'll read that. Pursuits. Done. Catch a Cuskiel. Started, though. Need to catch a Cuskiel and bring it back to them. Another person in robes. Double spawn. They asked me to catch a fish depicted on a paper scroll. Yeah, I don't know where the Cuskiel is. Um, we need to catch the uh, Colacanth. And the fang tooth. Bring it back to him. I'm guessing the fang tooth is probably going to be up in the volcanic area too because I haven't seen it anywhere else. And we've been all over the other places. So it's got to be up in the volcanic area. The figure in gold. And then the relics, the devil's spine. So everything else I think is probably going to take place in the devil's spine. Just my guess. Yeah, just my guess. We haven't found any more messages either, which is sad. What is this? A snag squid. A pale skate. Snake mackerel, which we caught by accident too. I didn't even realize. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we can just sell the rest of it. It's fine. And then we can sleep. And then that was going to do it for this episode. Uh, I know it's nothing major, but we did get a bunch of stuff done for sure. Almost ran that thing over right out of the gate there. Uh, we are going to head up here to the Twisted Strands and we'll end our saga off in the Twisted Strands, I do believe... Oh no, you know what? For the Twisted Strands, we need to go talk to the Lighthouse Keeper at Little Morrow. Uh, we'll do that in the next episode and then start the Twisted Strands. It's probably going to take a couple episodes to knock that one out. So I appreciate you guys. As always, check the links down below. I have lots of different stuff going on. I have three different YouTube channels. One is for my Twitch VODs from Farm Sim over on Twitch. And one is my main YouTube channel where I stream... Monday through Friday when I am home and then this one so subscribe to all three if you want to check out different content on each you can it's all there all the time for everybody to enjoy I appreciate you guys uh, also if you're looking to pick up dredge don't forget it's on my Nexus store just use the Nexus link down below that'd be appreciated uh, I appreciate you checking out the channel catch you next time later folks